New World's adding some new combat trophies to the game called Human Combat Trophies. And in this video, we're going to tell you everything you need to know about these trophies. If you're unaware, on March the 28th, a big update is coming to New World that's going to include seasons. Along with this seasonal update is coming a new expedition called the Empyrean Forge. Whenever you're inside of the Empyrean Forge, you're going to be fighting mostly Varangian enemies, which are human type enemies. So in order to fight these enemies, yes, you are going to need new Bane gear and new Ward gear. And then, of course, they are going to introduce a new trophy type called the human combat trophy the human combat trophy is not in the game currently but it will be added again with the update coming on march the 28th these trophies function just like any other trophy in the game and if you want an ultimate trophy guide i have one here on the channel I'll make sure to link that down in the description below so you can see how to get all the other trophies as well but these trophies also have a minor basic and major version just like all of the other trophies do in order to get a minor human combat trophy you can of course either buy one or you can craft one to craft one you're gonna have to have furnishing skill of level 75 a workshop of tier 3 or higher and you're gonna have to have 25 lumber 20 steel ingots one maple stain 25 death motes and then 10 flame cores the flame cores are where this gets a little bit different than the other trophies in the game flame cores are also getting introduced with this new seasonal update and they are a new item that you use in multiple different situations i'll have a guide coming out for flame cores a little bit later on but for now you do need them to craft your trophies in order to get a flame core to craft the minor version of the trophy you are going to need to go farm them they are buying on pickups you're not going to be able to trade them or purchase them off of the trading post and they drop from the new expedition the Empyrean Forge they drop from both mobs and chests inside of that expedition they're also going to drop from any chest from the new Varangian points of interest that are getting added with this update as well so there's three of these points of interest one of them is called Acadia Keep it's in South Eden Grove there's another one called Crystal Cavern in West Eden Grove and then there is one called Atlas's Foundry which is an elite zone in northern Ebon Scale Reach you can go there to farm these cores and if you're planning on crafting these yourself it's going to be a pretty important farm for you to do because you're going to need a lot of these cores just to craft the trophies not to mention the other items in the game that are going to require these cores as well so in order to craft a miner like we said before you need 10 of these flame cores a basic is going to require 50 and the major is going to require 150 of the flame cores so if you want to craft all three major trophies eventually you're going to need 630 total flame cores in order to achieve that goal now let's move on to the basic human combat trophy so much like the other combat trophies in the game you're going to need 20 25 weirdwood planks 20 star metal ingots one oak stain a minor human combat trophy and then 50 flame cores as we talked about before and then the artifact ingredient that you're going to need for the basic human combat trophy is called a human digit and this artifact ingredient can also be farmed alongside of your flame cores from any of those locations we previously talked about the varangians will drop this artifact as well and if you're unaware the artifact ingredient must be inside of your bag whenever you go to the crafting station to craft this particular item if you don't have access to the artifact ingredient it's not going to pop up in the crafting station so you're not going to have an option to craft the basic combat trophy you will only see the minor version listed there now on to the major human combat trophy much like the other major combat trophies in the game for this one you are going to need 25 ironwood planks 20 orichalcum ingots one mahogany stain the basic version of the trophy 150 flame cores which we've already covered and then the artifact ingredient for this particular trophy is called a human idol so this human idol idol can be farmed from an elite mob called Sir Juni the strategist. Sir Juni is located in the new Varangian elite zone called the Atlas's Foundry located in northern Ebonscale Reach. You can go there and farm the human idol shards as well just like you can farm the other shards from other bosses in the game that also drop the actual artifact ingredient. You need a hundred of the human idol shards in order to craft a human idol and then you can use that to craft the major version of the trophy. Currently Sir Juni has two spawn locations on the PTR. One of them is on the ship in the back of the Atlas's foundry. So you're gonna need to fight your way through the elite zone, jump on the ship, and then you can find his spawn there in order to farm out the trophy mad. The other one is just south, right on the beach. There's nothing around him on this spawn. So this one would be a much easier one to go to if you're looking to farm out the trophy mat solo, or if you have a small group of friends, or if you just don't feel like going through the entire elite zone. That is currently available on the PTR. I'm not sure if they're gonna change those spawns or not, but that is how it is right now on the PTR. You have one on the boat, one down on the beach. If they 
remove one i would assume it'll be the one on the beach so you have to fight your way through in order to attack the guy on the boat they may tie into the story somehow and that may be why there's two of them i'm really not sure but right now on the ptr there are currently two but as we know everything on the ptr is subject to change i highly doubt any of the ingredients or any of the things we've mentioned in this video will change for the human combat trophy except for potentially the spawn but that's it that's how you get the human trophy in new world this is going to be a new thing coming on march the 28th this is going to be something you're going to want to have whenever you're running the empyrean forge so at least be prepared and get yourself a minor version whenever this patch it's live on the 28th and then i think it's going to be easy enough to farm out the basic artifact ingredient just like it is for every other trophy in the game the hard part is going to be getting those artifact ingredients for the major trophy probably gonna have to farm him out quite a lot and i would imagine in the beginning those will probably be pretty pricey as well because a lot of people are going to be wanting them and they're going to be sought after there's not going to be a lot of them on the market so if you can get your hands on some might not be a bad idea to sell some either might be a quick way to make some coin but that's going to do it for this one boys and girls thank you guys so much for watching i greatly appreciate it and as always if you enjoy newer content please make sure to like and subscribe i greatly appreciate that as well and of course we stream every monday through friday over on twitch.tv slash bdog play a lot of new world play some other things every now and then as well too just have a good time over there in general and uh, i would love to have you over there but that's gonna do it for this one boys and girls thank you guys so much for watching we'll see you in the next one